Last evening, news that President Chom Seven had dropped Lieutenant General Henry Tumukonde and General Kale Kaihura from their positions as Minister for Security and Inspector General of Police, respectively, spread like wildfire over social media. The news of the president's new appointment came against a backdrop of much public rivalry between Tumukonde and Kaihura. Like many other Ugandans, members of parliament also had a range of opinions of the changes at the top of the security ministry and the police force. Some welcomed the changes, saying they were long overdue. In fact, the police force we have today is the pure political force, pure partisan force. I, I, I think it was really long overdue. I mean, the murders, the insecurity in the country, it's been going on, you know, it's unattended to. A number expressed the view that former IGP Kale Kaihura had stayed in the position for too long, which had begun to have a negative impact on the operations of the police. The circles that are supposed to manage the security of this country uh, have been operating in a manner which is not satisfactory to any Ugandan. That uh, uh, if new people come in and old go, it brings in new skills. Some of the lawmakers stressed that the new minister and the new IGP had serious tasks ahead of them because many were expecting them to make big changes. See, I, don't, I don't hope to get a new, a, new, a, a new breed in this thing. I think he has done the right thing. Just to see that uh, uh, this uh, situation is addressed. And we hope that uh, the new team will be able to do their best. The new IGP is a professional police officer. I know we shall not have any mistakes that we have been having. However, some lawmakers argue that the former IGP shouldn't be demonized, and they point out that he had done a lot for the Uganda police. Look at the, the, the construction of the police headquarters. It came under his regime. You can now see the flats which are being for the, to house the police officers. I think every police post, because the districts have also increased, so every police post, as we talk today, has a vehicle. Others believe that the alleged intrigue between Tumukunde and Kaihura could have been the reason for the reshuffle because it presented a risk to the security management in the country. The reason, you don't even find the, what, the, the culprits, they are not found. Although there are still so many issues, you remember the issue of abductions are still serious, people are no longer sure of their lives. The head of state could have realized that he, there is a gap somewhere which he needs that if this person is a, put in another office could serve better. A number of MPs then think Kaihura and Tumukunde should be given other positions because they still have a lot to offer. I so wish that he does not forget the services of some of these people like the IGP who has dedicated a lot and sacrificed a lot for this country. So we hope he can deploy him in a more suitable or, uh, place to encourage other people who are serving our government. It remains to be seen whether the future holds for the two men who have been very influential in managing security, law and order in the country. More research all NTV at Parliament.